The tracks have been laid and the railway stations are ready to go, but commuters in our southwest have a little longer to wait before trains reach their platforms. The government announced today that the Southwest Rail Link project has been finished a year ahead of schedule and the first trains will start operating next year. A week ago, becoming Premier may have seemed like a dream to Mike Baird. So you do this every Monday? <laughs> <laughs> but dreams do come true. We are turning dreams into reality. Uh, that is what a good government should be doing. Looking very much at home in his new role, announcing the completion of the $2 billion Southwest Rail Link. It is an incredible achievement, uh, close to 12 months ahead of schedule and under budget. Uh, they're two important measures that this government is delivering for every community across the state. 11.4 kilometres of track has been laid, connecting two brand new stations at Leppington and Edmondson Park to Glenfield and Rossmore. But not everyone's celebrating. Brian Malat has lived here since he was born. Now his fence line adjoins the car park. It's taken a while for it to get used to having all this construction next door and it'll probably take a while to get uh, used to all the people coming and going. Other residents considering moving out to make way for housing estates. If we do get a good price I will sell, if not I'll keep it till and I'll open my own business here. While both stations have been completed ahead of schedule, they won't be open to the public for some time. An exact date is yet to be confirmed. However, it will be some stage next year. There's also um, minor works we've still got to complete and obviously there's also a testing process. While one piece of infrastructure has been ticked off, there's more to be done to turn these paddocks into a thriving suburb. Kate Creedon, Nine News.